Hello, hello, hello. Welcome today to another Zerka Thursday. Today we are taking on a nice little challenge of a, a cheap versus expensive. Con and Kirsty behind the camera going away. They've gone shopping and found a bunch of items that are cheap, some that are expensive, and I have to compare them like blindfolded so it could be taste, it could be touch, it could be smell. Um, and I've got to try and guess which one is a cheap one, which one is an expensive one. Basically, are expensive products just a gimmick or not? You know, that is a real question here. So, Con Kirsty, fire away, you know, let me know. Also, what? subscribe. To me. No, not you, no, no, no. No, to, to me, yeah. You right. pointed at me, so. Yeah, it's camera. <laughs> Subscribe, please, please, please. We're taking on Square. That's the new one, all right? That's his, his name, Square. <laughs> candle. Defo candle. And my nose is literally in the wick. Now, the secret here, right? I can't smell anything. Why are you doing smell? I've got COVID nose still. Are they the same flavour? No, unfortunately not. So you've just got two different candles Similar. and I'm supposed to know which one's what. Oh look, this little ribbon here, this is Yankee Candle style. So there's a label, a lovely flavour right here, you know. Could be like linen or something. I'm not sure. This one's quite rustic. It's like charcoal. It's like wood. So this is your expense. Hang on, the candles are different though because you could have shit candles that are expensive. Is Yankee Candle expensive? No, it's like 20, 30 quid. This could be 100 quid. This is a bit ropey. That's not a Yankee Candle wick. That is not a Yankee Candle wick. They're much, they're much shorter than this. They don't feel like this. It's a scam Yankee Candle. It's like a spanky candle. All right, this is expensive. It's a rustic, expensive, molten brown. It was a spanky candle. The, the cheap one is from Aldi. Aldi. So what, 60 pound molten brown Russian leather candle, 60 pounds. And then spanky candle, three pounds from Aldi. The thing is, a spanky candle smells nicer for me. That's more of a Freya smell, more of a you smell, right? Russian leather. That is my candle. Russian leather of a smell. Like why, why would you want that as a smell? It smells amazing. Like twilight, you know? That's good, I'm keeping this. Big up Aldi. You can get 20 of these for this. Imagine 20 of these candles for this. Shambles. All right, next. I also like not knowing what the hell is in front of me. The fuck is that? You can give me like a tampon and I'll start feeling it up. Oh, it's tweezers, it's tweezers, it's tweezers. Okay, the key here could be the cap. This has got an expensive cap. That's why I can't be no friends, we have no cap. This is a little cheap elastic thing. Listen to the noise. Tweezers of all things, you can get expensive tweezers. Mm -hmm. Just go on Amazon, mate, go Amazon Prime, and just get whatever one delivers first. But if I do my beard, I have a beard like JJ though, like we'll patch you at the bottom. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, don't do it on your beard. Do it on up here, maybe. That one's kind of, that one's kind of rough. They're both kind of rough. How do you tell what's more expensive? It's a brand. This one's got a nice little rough edge here. This one's thicker. That way, it wouldn't even help me. Is there, is there a brand on them? I no, fuck it. This one's more expensive. One to my, this is this side because it had a more expensive cap. But it probably that's probably that's probably them like you know when you got like a small dick and you overcompensate and that's the word. They're overcompensating with their cap. But I'm gonna go for it anyway. You're right. Wait, what's tweezer man? It's fucking cold. I am cold at this game. You think you can defeat me? For extra points, what do you think the cost, like the price difference? Is? It's a pound. Okay, yeah, it's a pound. It's like nine pounds, seven pounds. It's twenty-two pounds for one. All right, items number three. I have no idea why oh, they want is. me in on this one. I honestly don't know why they want me here. Like a dildo, I think. Oh. Why are you scared of it? It could be a crab. Me that's bringing in a crab. That's a lube right there. <laughs> Your hands. I need to open this. No, you, 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 your hand, put your hands out. No, you put your hands out. You put your hands out. No, out. no hey, I, hey, I have hey, taken hey. time out of my day to I, come and sit I'm, here and spray this on your hand. Spray and this? It, yes. Oh, is it? It's not lube. That is lube, surely. Josh, let me put it on your hand. <laughs> I don't trust. I don't want to touch it. Josh, stop it. I don't want lube your hands. I got. I got. Oh! Josh! Oh my god! I've got stuff to touch after this. Oh, how are you? Oh, you got to turn the pump. God, you ain't good at this, are you? Clearly inexperienced virgin. Where are you putting it? Where have you put? Why are you put it there? Not on my hand. Sorry, is that not your hand? But it's, it's here, though. Can I have tissues, please? No, find like, out well, where it is. What is well, it? How long ago the one is now? Where is it? It's lube. I've said this. It's lubricant. You know, sometimes when you okay. when you're fixing your car, and you need to use lubricant you to make sure the parts what, work properly. This one. <laughs> oh, it's stringy. <laughs> it's stringy. He's trying to pick it up, and it's right, making I, me feel really uncomfortable. I, I, I think that the, the the tubular one, the longer one, is like 
I can't smell anything. I feel like the left one is the Durex one, but the right one is like a weird, but you have to take a while, you have to, it took a while to get it going. Can I find a pump? Where's the pump, please? I've literally got my hands all over it now, it's, it's a mess. Surely they wouldn't charge you a lot for this, because there's not much in it. Right, it's, it's fucked, <laughs> the whole tube's fucked. <laughs> Which, how much is Durex? It's cheap, it's what everyone uses, so this would make sense to be more expensive. And they went Poundland, and you got some Poundland tweezers and Poundland lube. It's a Poundland lube. I wouldn't trust Poundland lube. If Durex is only three quid, that's got to be more expensive. You, you think that's the expensive one? <laughs> well, if that one's Durex, Durex ain't that expensive, right? Is it six, like five, six quid? Wow, you've changed, bro. Well, can you take this off me because I can't touch it? Money's changed you, bro. Oh, it's like five, six quid for lube. That's not much, is it? Oh, it was Durex, though. Yeah, it was Durex. Pleasure lubricant. <laughs> My hands. No, I'm, I'm getting ready. No, 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 no. Okay, come on, come on. Can I have tissue? Uh, Boots Plesh Lubricant, three ninety nine dollars apparently. Uh, then we have Durex Strawberry, seven ninety nine. dollars well, Wasn't that far from the price? It's not that cheap and expensive though, you know? You could have got me a 20 quid one or a 30 quid one. Some Harrods thing, some gold, gold lube or something. You cheaped out on this one. One of them's called Dr. Pepper and the other one's called Professor Peppy. Professor Peppy. Hello, Professor Peppy. How do you do? He can catch you on this one. Did you really think? After all my years of experience, surely not. Professor Peppy, mate. Hello, Professor Peppy. How do you do? Oh, I'm really good, thank you, Dr. Pepper. Oh, it's too easy. Oh, it's too easy, Professor Peppy. 42p. Professor Peppy. Oh, no. This is £1.49 or something. Depends where you get it from. Sometimes you get it cheap. Sometimes you got to deliver it, it might cost you a fiver. Yeah, it's zero sugar as well, Professor Peppy. Is it, is it not, it's not a full fat Professor Peppy somewhere. It didn't have that one. Yeah, it's, it's, just, it's different gravy, you know? Professor Peppy. No, thank you. Keep it real. Actually, no, thank you to either of them, you know? I'm a changed man now, Chris Brown. <laughs> Item number five is this? What is this? Is it a dip? No. It's pesto. <laughs> Oh. What happened there? Uh -huh. it, it is liquid. I got, wait, is that lube in my hand again? <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, it is. I've got lube in my hand from the table. I've got luby hands. <laughs> There's lube on my container. <laughs> Look, it doesn't move. <laughs> my hands have no grip. It's just liquid. I'm a bad boy. Oh, I don't like, I don't, oh, it doesn't smell good. But that smells like ass. Like actual ass. Can I finger it? No, you can eat it with a spoon. I can eat it with a spoon? Yeah. Just what, put a spoon in there? There's a spoon in front of you. Is, that, is it like Manuka honey or something? One of them might be. Maybe the more pungent it is, the more expensive it is, surely. This is liquidy honey as well, right? Now this is that like proper Manuka honey, like it makes you feel better. So I got a bit of hay fever, it might help. Is there someone there? There's definitely someone there. Are you sure? There was someone there. There was? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's gagged on the spoon. <laughs> Horrid. <laughs> That's ass. Why do bees like that so much? What's wrong with them? It's sweeter. This is nicer, so it's cheaper. And this is like some cruddy one that you'd have when you feel really bad. And you'd say, you know what, this will help you. And then some doctor will go, hey, have some Manuka honey on this honey and it'll make you feel better. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, hey, I'm good at this game, you know. Oh, Manuka honey's ass. Is okay, so if your Aldi clear honey was uh, 85p and then Manuka honey was 25 pounds for a pot of honey. 25 pounds. <laughs> Jammy Dodger, but not. Is it an Oreo? <laughs> that, can't, that can't be a good Oreo, can it? Surely not. Expensive Oreo right here, aka real Oreo, and that's a Boreo. You can't tell me, can you, yet, either? Again, expensive. Kinder Bueno. Which one expensive. Which? That's my childhood right here. What is this, though? This feels like, it's more, what is it even called? Kinder No Bueno. Where's um Mr. Peppy, whatever it's called? I'm not dry. You got hybrid. Professor Peppy. Got a hybrid. You got a mix of both there now, actually. Yeah, not too shabby. Well, this one feels like a carpet. Kinder Bueno feels like a Kinder Bueno. This has got some weird texture to it. It's like, is, it, is it proper solid chocolate all here? Pretty good though. Never write off a cheap product. I'm getting so messy in this video. What's going on? Jammy Dodger. If I'm correct, does the original Jammy Dodger have like a heart there? And then this has a circle. Is that true? There's not much in the taste. I'm going to back my own trusting the heart unless I'm absolutely waffling, but I swear. The Oreo let me down by breaking. You know what it is? I don't have these Oreos. I have the double stuffed ones. They last more. And I have out the fridge. Cookies and cream, 35p. Wait, how much are these then? Oreo originals? A pound. A pound? I can get three of these for one of these. They're about 70p. And we have these spirals hazelnut, uh, which are £1.29 for all seven bars that you get inside here. It's about 20p a bar right there. 
done though. Less than 23 actually. Then, even better, right? We have jammy dodgers. And they're not, they're not whammy dodgers. They're jammy wheels. Man, like jammy wheels. So jammy wheels are 42p. And jammy dodgers are one pound something. One pound nine, one pound eight, one pound seven. Con's on his phone. One pound nine p, we'll make it up, why not? <laughs> Indiana Jones. What if you just dropped off? There's only one item there. Why is my, who put Louisville around here still? <laughs> Why is there watches? How do you get in a satchel? Take it out. You put up Indiana Jones. Okay, we have the uh, Jaeger Le Couture Reverso, right here. We also then have, this is a international watch company. Schrafhausen, it's a shark fin. Okay, it says Hodinky in the side. Well, that's, a, that's a great clue. Reverso, Swiss. Hey, the Swiss do make some good watches. Swiss made, 1,000 hours control. Jaeger Le Couture Formosa. They're both expensive or not? Yeah. They're both over 100 quid. Who gave, why is it an Indiana Jones satchel? Did he give you the watches? Harrison Ford. Why are you watches? laughing? Josh, I can't, I can't reveal my secrets. This one, has, this one has a seconds count hand, which I feel like might be more valuable. That one just seamlessly move. This one doesn't even work. What other clues you look for in a watch? What do you think about the name Reverso? Because the watch is in reverse. It's five to five though, so that is actually the right time. This is 2 p.m. apparently. Surely a good watch doesn't run out of battery. Let me check the actual workings of it. This watch belongs in here. Like, why would you put this watch? This watch, it, it, it's meant to be in here. Wait, and this is multiple watches. Is this your watch satchel? Is this your Indian? Indiana Jones' satchel. Well, how do I guess this? Oh, I think this one costs more. This one smells more like leather. This is, like, that's like real leather. I don't know why you're smelling it. Because leather, <laughs> right? Okay. Well, what, smell, smell, smell the metal? This one's overdoing it on the back with the information, you know? It's like some Michael Kors price range. 150 quid. He smiled, that's not good. <laughs> 300 quid, 400 quid, 500 quid, I don't know. It's been worn, so it's, it's, it's got lesser value, right? It's, it's not a retail price, only retail price because it's been worn considerably. Someone put some hours into this, and different sizes as well. Maybe they've lost weight over, over time, or they, or they gained weight maybe. I may just pass someone actually, I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> All right, reveal, reveal. The gold one, the Cal 89 shark fin, 1,000 pounds. This has to be expensive compared to this. Then. Can I show you why it's called Reverso? Oh, it's, it's gonna be it's more expensive, surely not. Show you why it's called Reverso. Surely it's not more expensive. So this is usually worn by polo players and they don't want to damage the watch. They just reverse it. Well, that's not fair. I didn't get to see that part, did I? <laughs> How, how? You, All you I, did was if, smell it, bro. If, just, I, if I had did that, I would have run away thinking I broke the watch. That's cool, isn't it? The reverse, though. Guess the price now. Yeah. In product is still more expensive. Okay. This is just cool. This is some one more po polo players. Polo players got peas, to be fair. All right, it's like four bags then, easy, isn't it? That's a little bit more than your rolling. Oh, no. 10. 10 for reverse, though. It's quite cool, though. <laughs> I was sitting all day, but that, 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 I did that on my watch all day doing this. I got it wrong. Yeah, you got it wrong. 10 bags. Yeah. That's not cheap. That's still a grand. I know, I said. It's only a 50 quid watch. I said they're both not cheap, but one of them. Give me a G Shock. Casio. This is one card. Oh, it smells around here. It's cologne. That's the bottle for that one. I don't feel the bottles yet. Oh, what's this? And then in this hand. Pretty good. The other card. I'm am, I, am I holding it the right way? No. No, try the other way. Are you sure? What is this? I hope this ain't cheap. I hope it is cheap, I can buy it. Is it, is it aftershave or is it perfume? Perfume. Oh, fuck it, I can't I'll buy it anyway. I'm a gangster. This is nice, this one. The thing is, cheap perfume, like the candle. Sometimes cheap perfume smells better than expensive perfumes and the brand gets you the price. Cause it might be this, this, like, this, might, this might last like 10 minutes, but this might last hours and hours and hours. And this is there, you know, mellow. Oh, it's tiny. Is that tiny for a perfume? Or, 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 or female just small? Hmm, interesting shaped bottle. They're trying to over, they're overdoing it, you know? Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Maybe the fact that it's such a tiny bottle, Look, it's expensive this is. You man can't afford the bigger one. That's why it is just like, oh, I'm not spending this on Josh. We're spending your budget, mate. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I'll allow it, Josh, doesn't need no perfume. Expensive, we're just gonna run it, we're just gonna run it, we're going for it. This one smells so much nicer, so I'm gonna, I like it more anyway. But I'm just saying with perfumes, it's hard to gauge sometimes. You can get a Poundland perfume, that it smells incredible, but it lasts like five minutes. I ain't got five minutes to wait here, you know? So we'll just run it, this one. Yes, no, maybe? Black opium, black dusk. <laughs> Eastern the wall. This one's nice. That's actually Kirsty's one pound one. Yeah. One pound? This one, is one pound. I saw it on TikTok. Everyone was saying it smells like it and I wanted to test it. It doesn't. It does. It actually <laughs> it does. does. I can't smell it. 55 pounds black opium, East in law. Uh, and one pound black dusk. Where's this from? Poundland. Poundland. Told you about the Poundland. Yeah. 
I'm gonna guess a t-shirt. You know how hard a t-shirt's gonna be? Because it could be like some plain white t-shirt or something, and it would have like a little logo right here, and it would say 90 quid. And this might be from TK Maxx, and it would say two pound. It's got a label in it still. Was that a label? Who didn't cut out the label? I have you. I have you now, mister. Okay, that's a good clue. It's got a good label on it. It's not some pesky embossed label. Very, very soft, a bit rougher. Feeling for labels, you know, to see if I can get a gauge of a label. There's no label in there, or there is a label. Cheap plastic labeling right here. Hey, you guys are best up. I've got you on the ropes. Don't know me as Tommy T. Feels pretty good. Feels like a t-shirt I could wear. It's nice little, that's like a little to try on test about trying it on. Oh, this has got some weight to it. Some, it's got some GSM different in here. This is heavy. It's not as soft, but it's heavier. They took my money on their fabric, maybe. Soft isn't always the key. What's this then? The line at the top, the line. It's a bit rounded off at the bottom. Fuck it, this is expensive one. Yes, I'll find out. What is that logo still? I don't know. Is it Burberry? Burberry. Told ya. Is there even a logo on this one? This is just Prime Arnie coming through. You can see through this if you get your nips out of you on this one. There's not, there's not enough stuff to it. Two pounds for the Prime Arnie t-shirt. And it's Burberry, so it's gonna be in the hundreds. We can't return it either. <laughs> yeah, we can't return it either. <laughs> 230 pounds. That's fine, I'll wear a, Bur nice. I'll wear a Burberry t-shirt, it's fine. <laughs> My, my budget on my video! Please subscribe, guys! <laughs> what are you doing? It's not the Sidemen channel! Could be a moisturizer? It is a moisturizer, right? Yes. Uh, am I moisturizing my face with like an ass moisturizer or something? Pile cream. Whoa! <laughs> no! It's, it, it, it smells brush. pretty. It smells pretty nice. <laughs> brush cream. If it's fresh cream, it smells pretty nice. You know, put it on your face. Why not? If you're in a rush, you know, just use some fresh. Sometimes these cheap companies don't overdo it. They give like some pretty, pretty colourful and stuff as well, right? When they've got the protective thing on it, you know they're about their business. Lancome, Lancome, you know, that brand or it's called. Yeah, different, smooth, rubs in easy. This is like sun cream. This is just, it's in there. It's already, it's already been swelled up by my skin. It loves it. My, my skin's eating good now. Lancome, expensive. Dunno, the Dunno. No, what the hell? <laughs> 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 Say, Nizzy. See that? You see me? All bright with hibiscus night cream. Fuck off. Uh, Lancome Genetic Repair. No, no, Genetic Repair. Repair? No, thank you. So this is like probably 60 quid? 50 quid? Four quid. 6.99, uh, 55. I know my stuff, you see. I know my stuff. How do you know your stuff? <laughs> I know my stuff, you see. Shoe box. Shoelaces. Ah, oh, that's good. Right, let's go one at a time then. I won the one's expensive. You got a custom pair of shoelaces and you get a bag with it. And these are my size. If you bought me in someone else's size, then this is a violation. What the fuck is this? Pair of no two ways, no? They got a whole thing in it as well. They got a, they got a bunda of a shoe on the shoe, look. Okay, let me just put it off the train. <laughs> I wonder which one is the cheap one. It couldn't be bothered to connect the box. What on earth is this? This is like the Balenciaga uh, sock crepes. They actually aren't. These are Balenciagas. Does that mean these, uh, they're not, these aren't actually Balenciagas, are they? Like the moon boot style ones. Has there been a box switcheroo? Nah. These wouldn't fit in this box. Oh. <laughs> these are in Kirsty's size. You little scallywags, you got yourself some Balenciaga socks. You can fool me on my channel. Do you know who I am? And what earth are these? These are crepes. These are giant crepes. Hello? It's Balenciaga, isn't it? They feel, they feel waham. One hand, you need two hands. I mean, whoever's got these size crepes, I've got a huge hog, surely, clearly. Not what they say, fuck off Balenciaga things. Big fuck off hog. It's the right foot. That's not the right foot, is it? It's not your size. <laughs> it's not my size. <laughs> I'm good at this game, though. Flintyard, you've got these, oh, <laughs> but, but you want these. They're not even in my size, they're a size four. That's right, Fred, a size four. <laughs> you thought you could catch me out. 25 pounds, TK Maxx. 795 pounds. Balenciaga. I go to the gym, you know. Well, it's fairly in games about to start, so chin chin. Wait. This is your favourite drink. In no way. In here, 
It smells like nail polish. Is my nose working? You're testing it me against my own favourite drink. I'm concerned now, because I can't smell the difference. I can smell a perfume in my nose. Yeah. This, is, this is Coco Canoe, yeah. and this is Coco... Coco Bay. It's not that, not that, not that strong. Yeah, that sounds like Coco Bay. This is more expensive than this. This is Coco Canoe, it's 20 quid. So this is three quid. Come on, the Coco Bay, you know, get yourself, what the hell? Get yourself crunk on the Coco Bay. England game's about to start, I need to go. So, if you enjoyed, leave a like on it as always. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe, come through. Subscribe to me, not the square, you know, because we need more subscribers in the square. Catch you up on him though, we are. It's, look, it was easy. The E boys in the mud, mate, down there somewhere eventually. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. It's coming home. It's coming. I'm a Marcus, bit excitement, like it's a circus. Wanna see more exciting things? Check my YouTube channel or circus. If you hear something in my bar, you think I didn't even know that I said? Boy, better know when I'm on the mic and I speak, better know that I said it on purpose. That's right, I'm a Marcus, saying it again.